Hello everyone, welcome back to Lost Alpha. It's time to mingle amongst the locals. I do need to give the military documents to the barkeep, but before that, let's talk to this rather shady looking figure in the corner because he never stops talking to me. And his name is Snitch. So of course I trust him. Hello Marked One, my name is Snitch and I know many things. Little stories that may rouse your interest. Want to know something interesting about the zone? Hmm. Well, I've only got 6,000 monies. And I don't exactly trust that your information is valuable. That's strange. There's two options that both are a thousand. Both, co both cost a thousand. Hmm. I wonder if those are just like different grades of information. You know, 500 is worse than a thousand, or if they're just totally different pieces of information. Given that there's two 1,000 costers, I'm guessing they're all different. Either way, I need to secure my equipment first, so I'm going to save my money for now. Come here. I've always got something in blah, 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 blah. Like you. Hey, Marked One, you've got something for me. Ratcatcher, you wanted me to help him, right? Well, here's the alibi needed so that the military will let him off the hook. Great work. Fast, clean service. We could use a guy like you around here. Apparently you're looking for that Strelok fellow. Am I right? How about you work for us some more? You never know what might pop up about him. World's a small place. I can guarantee you that. Okay, I scratch your back, you scratch mine. That's good. I've got an itchy back. Sure, but no suicide missions. Am I clear? Okay, stalker. I've got something for you then. Still high risk, but take it or leave it. There's some boys down in the Dark Valley, at the old stables, and they need help with dealing with the local dime a dozen cultists, the monolith goons. Oh god. <laughs> They've managed to not get killed by both thugs and fanatics, so they must be doing something right. Maybe you already know, uh, no, since you're involved with Sid, but we traders are interested in learning a route to Pripyat and the NPP, a pass the dreaded, uh, a pa pass the dreaded brain scorcher. Apart from this man of myth, the so-called guide, Nobody is said to have been there, and lived to tell the tale. Hmm. There's something related to the labs in the Dark Valley? Apparently so. Best bet is that the Monolithians got it under their control. I'm not that informed about it. Colonel Petrenko knows best. Go talk to him. He's in the back room. He's deeply invested in this sort of research, mainly because it might lead to these sin guys he hates so much. Alright, let me back there. I'll talk to him myself. I'm looking to buy a vehicle! <laughs> so I can buy vehicles from him. Not that I can afford any, of course. Yep, the cheapest is 150,000. Oh, I'm so gonna buy a tractor. I'm gonna drive across the zone in a freaking tractor. Oh yeah. It's okay for now, though. I need to, uh, save up. You know, get a little bit of cash from the Tooth Fairy. Ask my parents for an allowance. Alright, you have a job for me? Hmm. A bunch of small jobs. I think I want to take a bunch of small jobs and just kind of explore around here before I go to the Dark Valley. To meet the Monolithians. Because that sounds dangerous. Really dangerous. Uh, first, let me see what you have. Okay, now we're in business. So, I'm gonna sell my junk. Um, hold on. So, first thing I'm gonna do, do is unequip my noiseless pistol. Because this weapon here is actually better in every way than the noiseless pistol. Except that it makes no more noise, of course. But it's lighter, better accuracy, more damage, better handling. Even a better rate of fire. So, I'm gonna keep one of these. And I don't think I need this many artifacts. I'll keep a couple on me, but I'm going to sell everything else. Alright, let's see how much money I can get. Sell that, sell that. Um, I don't need most of this food. I don't think I need the alcohol. I was kind of collecting it for radiation, but I've got some radiation medication. So, you know, I'm going to keep a couple. I'll keep two. Yeah, I'll keep two. And let's sell all of these artifacts. 
Ooh, that's some nice money. Sell all this alcohol, aside from the vodka. Um, let's see, that's... Alright, this is my pistol ammo, so I can sell that. It's for the pistol I don't use anymore. This pistol takes the, uh... 919mm rounds. Which is this. Let's see. Why are both of these red? Does that mean they're broken? Does that mean you can't sell them? Oh, I can't sell them. Hmm. I feel like I never use grenades, and they're quite heavy. But I probably shouldn't sell them. No, mm. I'll keep them. Oh, I don't think I can sell the hands. Yeah, and I wouldn't want to, because I think they need to go to scientists. It looks pretty good, so I've got a bit of food here. In fact, I can sell some of this. I don't need all of that. I'll keep, uh, I'll keep two. I'll keep two waters as well. I'll keep, like, two food, two water. That'll be fine. And there we go. I am now about, like, one-twentieth on my way to a vehicle. But, uh, let's spend it on ammo and stuff, huh? How's my weight, by the way? 31 out of 50? Okay, I've got plenty of room. I think I've actually got enough ammo for this thing. I can't even take out my weapon to see exactly. 60, 70, 80, 90. I've got like, um... I've got like 140 rounds, roughly. That's pretty good. I mean, it never hurts to have more, obviously. I do need rounds for the pistol, though. Honestly, though, I'd rather just have more rounds for my assault rifle than even have the pistol at all. I kind of don't even want to carry around a sidearm. It doesn't really serve a function that my main gun doesn't. So, what kind of armor do you have? Stalker suit? I've already got one. That's probably the best armor you have. Yes, so no point in getting that. Hmm. I don't want a shotgun. I really don't want to carry around two weapons. Unless my secondary weapon is a pistol. Because that doesn't weigh much. Just because of the weight issue. Oh, that's a repair kit. And holy crap, that is expensive. 16,000. Damn. Gas mask. Hmm. Um. Okay, during the blowouts, the air becomes polluted and you need to wear gas masks. Otherwise, you will get radiation infection and you'll die in a few minutes. It can be useful in underground areas too since they're locked since they were locked down a long time ago. Sounds like I might actually need that. And I've heard you want this thing here. To store all downloaded information from computers, supports Wi-Fi and remote access via system based on Linux. I've heard that you uh, I've heard that you really, really want to take that before you go to uh, what's it like the X18 laboratory or something? There's some laboratory where you need it. And because I'm probably gonna forget it, I'm just gonna buy it right now. It's really expensive, but I'm just gonna buy it before I forget it. Because I think I will regret it if I don't. Let's buy all of the batteries. I also need bandages. How much does this weigh? Oh, they weigh almost nothing. 0.10. Suppose I should buy some pistol ammo. Or, eh. You know what? I think I'm just not going to use a sidearm. Yeah, I'm just not going to use a sidearm. That's what I'm going to do. Alright, so that's armor piercing, right? Yeah, so I'll keep some armor piercing for people and a bunch more for mutants. Maybe I should just buy it all. I should probably just buy it all. You really don't want to run out of ammo. You really, really, really don't. Okay, anything else I want? Because I think I'm good to go. I mean, I could just get the gas mask just in case. Let me go ahead and just sell my pistol, actually. So how's my weight now? Yeah, 33.5. Yeah, that ammo doesn't weigh too much. It's fine. There we go. Two stacks of AP, four stacks of... Standard rounds, ten bandages, bunch of batteries. I think I'm good to go. 
So what about that gas mask? Like, where do I put it? Can I just, like, drag it onto my face? I guess... No? Let's find out. Where did it go? There it is. Is it... Oh, shit, it's got a timer. Wait, where... Can I not take it off? I don't see it. Shit, okay, okay, okay. So, yeah, I don't think I can take it off. It's just like a consumable that lasts for a certain amount of time. Okay, well, I wasted that one. <laughs> but now I know. Let's buy another one, and I'll just keep it on me. Probably doesn't weigh too much. Ooh, it's actually pretty heavy. But, uh, that's fine. Seems prudent to keep it with me. What is this? X-Virus Antidote. It was developed in the X-18 labs in 1989. This is highly valuable and rare item in the zone. It also boosts immunities during blowouts, which can be very handy if you find yourself far away from a shelter. It's too expensive, but uh, given how expensive it is, it's probably very useful. And given the... Given that I'm not having a weight problem, I think I'm just going to buy the rest of this ammo for my gun. There we go. Alright, we're good to go. Well, I got a bit of money left over, and I don't really have anything pressing that I need to spend it on. So, let's go ahead and I guess buy some information, I suppose. See if we can learn any juicy secrets from Snitch. If you like snitching, man. Let's go with the cheapest one first. Do you have enough money? Yes. Okay. A while ago, a group of stalkers attempted to reach the center of the zone, right through the brain scorcher. As you must know, the path to Pripyat and beyond is covered with deadly psi emissions that make your brain boil, turning humans into soulless beasts. However, it is said that the group marched on and disappeared. Hearsay among expert stalkers is that members of the group returned, but no one really knows how they did. No one really knows if this even happened, though it makes you wonder. Well, thank you for the tale. How much do I have left? 3,400. Alright, let's go for the most expensive one. There's a place called Countryside Past Radar. It's rumored that there is a stash there that is beyond what anyone could imagine. Apparently it requires a leap of faith. Whatever that means. They say you can find it on the WC Island. And you'll know when you see it. It is also rumored that a map to this wonder stash is hidden in the forest somewhere in a humongous anomaly formation. Whoa. Wait, new stash information, Eye of the Storm. How do I access that stash information? I feel like I should write this down, but it sounds like it might have it marked on the map for me. I think it's marked on the map. Let's see if I can find it. Wait. Well, if it's not here, then it's got to be on a different map. Uh, which, <laughs> which one? Well, here's... Oh, wait, is that it? This is the forest. Eye of the Storm. Shit, that's it. Oh my god, I do not want to go to a fucking forest. Strolls through the forest are normally wonderful. I don't think that... That, says, that doesn't sound wonderful. I'm pretty sure that is... That would not be a pleasant forest stroll. Okay, that, that was actually good information. I almost want to buy more. Yeah, okay, I'm going to go broke doing this, but fine. I'll get more money. You know the bandit base in the Dark Valley? They keep all their stuff in the underground storage, though it is heavily guarded. If someone is crazy enough to rob them, then he could sell their supplies to Barkeep and get some good money out of it. Okay. Good to know. Yeah, let's work some jobs here before I continue on the main quest. Well, I suppose I should at least talk to... Pr Patrinko? Plinko? What's his name? Patranko. Do you think you'd mind if I went behind the bar? Hey man, I'm gonna help you wash dishes. Oh, never mind, there aren't any. Hmm, what's back here? No, I can't open it. Oh well. I 
almost smashed my face with that door. Hello. I like your armor. You also appear to be emitting radiation, so I'm going to stand very far away from you. That's a creepy room. Hello? Is there anyone back there? Nice monitor, dude. I like how the front of it seems all melted. Good day. You're Colonel Petrenko, aren't you? Ah, so you're that guy Zadorovich has been playing around with. Fresh from a death truck, too. How golden. The name is Petrenko. Colonel of Duty? Second in command of General Veronin. Nice to meet you, Stalker. Nice to meet you, too. Now, what's this whole business in the Dark Valley? Simply put, we've had some stalker boys telling us some intriguing things about monolith activities. Apparently there's a lab named, named X-18 under their base. I'm not sure what exactly is buried under there, but neither do the monolith. They can't open it yet, or maybe they don't want to. The information is pretty sketchy. And you want in. Whoa, what the hell is this? <laughs> I think it's a spam ad. This will change your life. Are you tired of scavenging? Having no money? You want to own your time? Own your life? Become a financial advisor like me. Show... Show your... What does that say? Show your... Show your who's boss? What? Show your something who's boss and take your life into your own hands in a fresh and new environment. It looks like... Yeah, it looks like it just cut off. Something something. With successful people, call... Oh my god, that's like a 20 digit number. That's a catchy number. You can turn that into a jingle. Just call 0885755377698854545-54. Anyway, and you want in? Exactly. Whatever's in those labs will attract the sins. Those damn aberrations. Go to the old barn. The mates over there have a pretty solid plan. Bring me whatever you can find after your digging, and I'll reward you handsomely. Any bit of info, however small, can be crucial. Wait, this is my only dialogue option, is to say this? I guess I'm gonna be a dick. Really? Sounds like old crap to me. Just think about it for a second. And the old experiments back in the days were pretty extensive and could provide the backbone for new ones. That kind of information are great... That kind of information is great bargaining chips for duty, and Sin will surely show themselves to gather it. Okay. Now what is this about repairing? You can repair stuff? Oh, excellent. Let's go ahead and repair my suit. Oh, right. I spent my money on information. <laughs> well, that's not going to happen. What about this? How much money do I have? 428. How much does it cost? That doesn't seem to say how much it's going to cost to repair it. Unless it's 20,000, but that seems implausible, to say the least. Wait. I can give my stalker suit night vision, but it already has night vision. I don't understand. Anyway. Anything else? Whoa. To turn the computer on, press F. I can turn on the computer? What the hell is this? Whoa. Dude. Lost Alpha has usable computers? This is amazing. Images. What? What is this? Is this like concept art? Is this like bonus, or is this like part of the game world? That one's... that one's locked. One, two, three, four, five? Nope. Holy crap, what is this? It's a movie. Dream Doctor. Wasn't that the, uh... This is so important. 
Why didn't you explain what you are going there for? And where did... It's out of sync for some reason. But uh, yeah, I think that was like the original introduction to the game or something. To all. If you assholes drink all the vodka again, you'll be severely punished. Even if you are drunk, for God's sakes, do not fill the empty bottles with water. It's not funny at all. You have no idea how unhappy General Piora was during the last inspection. Now, I expect all the patrol reports for tomorrow, and I need to find 20 bottles of vodka for the next inspection. One more thing. Due to my bad luck in poker, you won't get your salary for at least the next two weeks. <laughs> what a wonderful and respectful and dignified captain. Let's download this. For some oh, I can't even. Never mind. This even has Tetris? What the hell is this? This is amazing! Alright, well I don't want to spend forever in this, there's like a bajillion things to look at. It's even a puzzle! What? Uh huh? <laughs> what? <gasps> oh my god. That is so cool. What the hell? Is this a game script? Why? Huh. Interesting. Well, I'll look at that a bit more later. I don't want to spend this entire episode in here. Whoa. Is he not going to mind if I open his safe? Shh, don't look. Oh, pff, requires a freaking code. Alright, let's get a job and let's go do some exploring. I don't want to spend the entire episode in the bar. What time is it? Um, ooh, it's almost midnight. I should probably just sleep. Because the jobs might be time limited, and I don't really want to go out at night. If I can help it. Let's go ahead and sleep. Let's go ahead and sleep for eight hours. Yeah, I think I'll take... Um, I kind of want to take every single mission I can, but they might be time limited, which might make that a rather bad idea. So, we'll see. I'll take one and I'll see if it's time limited. You okay there, buddy? Wakey, wakey. Let's go ahead and eat and drink. Okay, now it's four in the morning. Alright, so it's still going to be dark, but it'll be fine. It'll be light pretty soon. Meat Chunk Artifact, bandits or zombies? Let's take Meat Chunk. Okay, left orders for a Meat Chunk. Sure. In fact, I might have just sold one. I don't know. Sure. I'm assuming he just wants it and he doesn't have a specific location. Is this a meat chunk? No, it's not a meat chunk. Hmm, it doesn't have a uh, it doesn't have a time limit, so let's just take another one. All right, kill some bandits. This one does have a time limit. Let's see how close. Whoa. You want me to go all the way down there? That's here, right? I guess it's not that far. Honestly, I don't know if I care to do that, though. The rewards you get for these missions seem to be only, like, a couple thousand money. And then, like, a med kit and, you know, minor stuff like that. Let's see what the next one is. Oh, you won't give me another one until I, I guess, complete these. Okay, well... If I find myself down there, then... Sure. No one else got some missions. Hey, Baldy. That wasn't insult, by the way. That was actually his name. <laughs> his name is Daniel Check Death. I can't even pronounce his last name. Killer Angel. Nice name. Sounds like the lead singer for a metal band. Excuse me. Excuse me, excuse me, never mind. Here we go. Please can you help me? Yes, I can. 
What's wrong? I'm so embarrassed. I was walking through the wild territory by myself, and I was mugged by some bandits. They took my prized possessions. My prized possession, my rifle. I'm too scared to go and get it. Please help. I'll make it worth your while. Sure. Maybe I'll keep the rifle for myself. No, I'll probably give it back. Mm, I think that's everybody. Did I talk to you? Alright, yeah. Not as many missions as I thought there'd be. Alright, where do I have to go for this? Oh, it's right over there. Alright, sweet. So I get to explore this place. Which is precisely what I wanted to do. I said come in! Don't stand there! I'm, I'm going, I'm not coming. I'm just waiting for somebody to tell me to get out of here, stalker. Is this the way I... Where did I come from? Ah, this way. Find my way out of this maze. Hmm. Anything up here? Secrets? High up secrets? Ooh. It's like a cabin up there. Oh, don't mind me, I was just looking at the stars. Hmm. How do I get up there? Oh. Oh god, probably copyrighted music. Run away from it. You two police are coming. Ah, get me out of here. Oh, holy shit! It's fucking RPG ammo. Wow. Where is that radio? Oh. Oh, there's nothing in it. I do seriously need to get away from that copyrighted music, though. Run away even if it breaks my legs, I don't care. Go, go. Alright, let's take a look at that stuff. It's probably really heavy. Yeah, a kilogram each. Do I sell it or keep it? I mean, honestly, when am I ever going to freaking need an, an RPG? I should probably just sell it. I really should. But I don't really want to go back to sell it. Uh, yeah, I'll just keep it on me for now. Getting in here was so hard, it's going to be a bitch to get out. I think I came from up here. Yeah, I think so. Hmm. Lots of... Graffiti? I don't know if that's graffiti or warnings or what. Yeah, this is definitely the way. Okay. Alright, let's make a hard save and let's go exploring. I'm of course not going to just go to my goal. But, uh, just check out everything along the way, too. Yeah, let's check out these buildings, see if I can go inside of them. See if I can find... Well, there's an artifact. Maybe it's a meat chunk. I just realized I never bought an improved anomaly detector. The bar I don't think the barkeep had one, but that guy outside did. Oh, shit. There's the meat chunk. That was easy. 
Okay, I don't think I can go inside of these buildings. Might be stuff up there. If I could somehow find my way up there. Takes my eyes a while to adjust after turning off the night vision. Do I want to leave it on? I guess I should. Yeah, I suppose I should. It makes everything look unnatural, but it does make it easier to see. What about that ladder? Hmm. If I can get up there, I could get up to the ladder. I feel like there's something good up there, so how do I get on this pipe? That is the question. I don't see a way. I mean, I could jump down from there, but if I jump down from there, then that means I'm already on top of the building. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe it's just a tease. Ooh, a lot of radiation. Oh, shit, yep. I am now infected with radiation! Oh god. Might be able to get on that wall, though. Yeah, if I could get up there. Which, you know, if I stood up here... Oh, stash. I'm gonna get so bad radiation poisoning from this, but uh, I'm gonna try to do it. Let's go. Come on. Come on! Yes, 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 yes. Okay, now my radiation poisoning is horrible. Uh, yeah. There we go. Now it's manageable. Now I'm going to walk on the wall while drunk. I, I seriously, like, can't walk at all. I, I don't even walk in the right direction when I press a certain button. I, uh, nope. That, nope, that's not gonna work. Okay, I'm gonna wait here for a second. After about two years, it finally went away. Also, it seems like there's an invisible wall here because I can't actually walk in this direction. So... Let's see if I can even get on this wall, because I don't know if... I might just not be able to walk far enough in that direction to stay on it. Yeah, it's not gonna work. Okay, well, that was a waste. Uh... What the fuck? Was that phone just ringing? Alright, that's creepy as hell. Go check inside of these buildings. Oh shit. More radiation. Yeah, what's my radiation protection? It's almost 50%. Oh shit. It's those things. Alright, I'm gonna run in and grab this. Okay, I think I'm okay? Yeah, I'm okay. It'll probably get worse as I get closer to the vehicle. No, no, it doesn't. If 
I should start shooting at the thing from afar. They're rather nasty up close. Aw, what a cute little lamp. Ooh, bandages. And ammo. Sweet. Layasho got so drunk last night that he lost his boots. If anyone finds them, please bring them to me. <laughs> Alright, where'd that thing go? I hear it. I'm gonna get some high ground. I think it's over there. In the trains. Let's see if there's some stashes up here. You know, I feel like, like I've found quite a few stashes, you know, backpacks and stuff like that, but they usually don't have anything in them. I'm thinking that maybe the stashes aren't populated unless you find their coordinates. Possibly. Because I have a vague memory of that being true. Which, if it is true, it's, it's not a system I like, but uh, that might be the case. Okay, I hear you, but uh, I don't see you. Where the hell are you? Shit! Damn it, you fall like a stone as soon as you fall off of anything. I wanted to get on the pipes. There we go. There you are. Damn. One shot. Ah, oh, there's one inside. Nah, he's clipping through the uh, train, but I can't shoot him through it. I hear dogs. Pseudo dogs. I don't know if there's a safe way down from here. There's another one. Their pathfinding is not very good. I can't even get in there. They might have scientific parts on them that I can sell to scientists. Ah, but I will never know. Unless I can do this? No. I don't think you can crouch jump. No, you can't crouch jump. Just as I can't find my way inside, they can't seem to find their way outside. Alright, so we're getting pretty close to my destination. So it was stolen by, like, bandits or something, right? So I'm assuming I'm going to be shooting people. Shit, this place is going to have so much radiation. Okay, I'm doing okay. I've got a little bit of poisoning, but I'm okay. This place is a bust. There's a pseudo dogs down there. That is where I need to go.
I want to see what's around here, though. Friend or foe? Looks like a bandit. Turn off my light. It's hard to tell. <laughs> Those definitely look like bandits, though. Uh, oh, yeah. It's red. Oh, yeah, this gun does have better accuracy. So, maybe I can actually snipe them. Let's try it out. He's going to where the bullet hit, I think. He's not even looking at me. Hmm. That's an interesting reaction. Wow, he's just leaving. <laughs> okay. Bye. Now, where did the robed guy go? Ooh, hello. Shit. How did you just throw a grenade that far? Holy hell, man. That is impressive. world-class thrower here. That was a terrible throw. That guy doesn't even care. There's another guy in there that doesn't seem to care. I see a shadow moving on the wall. I should probably use armor piercing. Not that I seem to need it. I'm going to change my batteries. Not a good time. Eat on that! Joke on that, I mean. I guess that'll be my action movie one-liner. Eat on that! Sounds menacing, doesn't it? Someone's going to shoot me in the face while I'm doing this. Batteries, batteries, batteries. There we go. I don't think that grenade did anything. Let's clear this place. Make sure there's no... dicks hiding in the corner. Nope, seems to be clear. Alright. Let's take a look around. Classic guitar. I don't even know if I want to take this stuff just for, like, for loot. For ammo, uh, I mean, to, to sell. It is worth quite a bit, the weapons. Hmm. Well, I'll take it for now. Because I don't have a weight problem at the moment. That one's indestructible. <laughs> One round of this stuff. 
That's actually really expensive ammo. Ooh, interesting gun. Yeah, a lot of double barrel shotguns. Definitely not very well equipped bandits. Actually, I think I'll just dump the double barrel shotguns and just keep the more important stuff. So let's take a look at this thing. What is this? VLA Special Assault Rifle. Whoa. Look at the accuracy on that thing. That's better in every single every single way than my current weapon. Unfortunately, it has almost no ammo. It's based on the Vintar Noiseless Sniper Rifle, but it has a folding butt, can fire bursts, and has a larger magazine. Can I put a scope on that? Oh, yes! <gasps> nice. That's a weapon to take careful, measured shots with, though. Since the ammo seems to be really damn expensive. I'm gonna try this thing out. I wish I knew how to change firing mode. Let me try. Is it... No, that's not it. That's not it. Why is ammo type? Question mark? No. Yeah, I have no idea how to change firing modes. I don't remember. Because this should probably be on single shot. Let's go get that weapon back. This place has a ton of anomalies. A <laughs> lone light bulb lighting up the room. Check out this building. Let's switch guns, though. Oh yeah, no scope. Ah, oh, it's fine. It's fine. I feel like maybe this was the building that had the suit in. Like, I remember going into a building here with tons of radiation and finding a suit or, or like, something super special. Maybe it's the weapon. I don't know. Go nice and slow, nice and thorough. There's an artifact out there. And something running, but I don't need to worry about it coming inside. Dogs are very bad at using doorways. It's an eerie light. Look at that. I don't think I can go forwards anymore. Hmm, apparently I can. Whoa. Holy shit.
Okay, some food, some alcohol. Yeah, I don't think I'm going in there. Well... I mean, it's not exploding when I throw it right in front of me. It doesn't look safe, but... The bolt seems to be okay. Here we go. Radiation? No, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm pretty sure I can't go that way. Nope. Or that way. There's gotta be something in here, right? Wait, 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 what's that? Medkit, radiation drugs, and a bandage. Uh... Yeah, why not? Whoa, that's a big hole. Yeah, you're not gonna live going down there. How the fuck did you get there, though? Do I have to, like, jump on the wood? Over the pit? This, this does not seem worth it. Uh, okay, okay. Jesus, this is a really good stash point. Like, who the hell would ever go here? Why am I here? I shouldn't be here. Give me, give me, give me. Okay, now I just need to leave. You know what? I want to see if I can go out the window. Or perhaps to the roof. No. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on, hold on. This might work. Maybe? Uh, I don't think I'm going to fit. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. Oh, uh, no. Alright, let's try going up. Ah, here we go, here we go. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, thank god. Thank god. Hmm, what's up here? Is that where I just was? Yeah, that's where I just was. Don't break your legs. Don't, don't, don't. Uh, uh, okay. Whew. That was fun. Now let's go pick up that artifact. They seem to be territorial. Then or they just have messed up pathfinding. I'm gonna leave them alone. One day we're gonna sort this place out. We're gonna make order here. And I don't mean just clean places to live. I mean real order. A little perfect state inside of a state. Like the Vatican. Or something else I just said. Didn't see the last part. Alright, this thing has so little ammo now that I'm just gonna take the- what the fuck? Did that even do damage to me? I don't even know that did damage to me. Fucking rats. Uh, uh. 
Oh, yeah, that, that does damage. Oh shit, I'm using armor piercing. <laughs> Whoops. Annoying little wastes of ammo. Well, maybe I'm gonna steal the weapon back from the Rat King. Hello? Ooh. I think I can snipe him from above. You'll never expect me up here. Oh yeah. N never mind, he will expect me. Well, now this is just a shitty position. Secrets? Are there secrets here? I'm probably not even supposed to be here. Okay, where did you go? See if I can get down here. Okay, yep, yep. Uh, there we go. Oh shit, radiation, radiation! Ah, not too bad. Not too bad. Got a little bit of it though. So let's uh, let's go into battle drunk. Come on, fight me! Anyone? Anyone? Nah, I think that's it. Okay. It's worth a decent amount. Doesn't weigh much. Mmm, nice medkit. Ah, that's the rifle. So I'd like to know how good it is, because, you know, it is possible I want to keep it for myself. He'll never know if I got it if I just never return it to him. You know, maybe I failed. I'm quite a bit overweight. Hunter shotgun. Hmm. Well, the rate of fire is obviously terrible. It's actually really accurate. It does a lot of damage, too. But no, I'll just give it to him. Drop the heaviest crap. I definitely want to keep this VLA special assault rifle. There we go. My weight is good to go. Let's eat a little bit of food. 
Let's dump these bad grenades. Oh my god, take it faster. Alright, cool. Let's return the loot. I've already gone through almost all my batteries. How do I get back? I'm kind of gated in here. I guess I go to the right? Let's see if I can go through these barracks. No. Shit, I don't know if I want to go down there. No, that's gonna yeah, that's gonna lead me out. Hmm. Maybe I can uh, break my legs to get out. I can't even get up, get up there. Shit. Oh my god. I'm gonna take radiation medication for that. I don't feel like getting drunk. Your rats. Fuck them. Nope. 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 Energy drink on the go? Just uh, run through a field of anomalies like a madman. Oh, not that close to him. Stay a little bit further away. Do, 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 do. I don't need no bolts. Just need my eyes. Here we are, let's return his shotgun. About your weapon. Mm-hmm, here it is. Two thousand monies, all right. No problem, take care. Let's go ahead and sell our, all our garbage. Actually, I should probably, yeah, I'm here for the job. Let's get that out of my inventory first so I don't accidentally sell it. There we go. Sell all the pistols I don't use. Sell everything but one of my alcohol. Sell the RPG ammo. Probably never going to need that. I don't actually want to use any of these artifacts. Go ahead and sell them. I think that's it. Yeah, I've got a pretty good amount of money now. 11,000. Okay, do you have more batteries? Yes, you have eight batteries. I'm gonna buy every single one. Give me all of your batteries. Good on bandages, good on med kits. Food and water's fine. Damn. I feel like there's something I feel like there's something else I wanted. Um Simple anomaly detector. Right, do you have a better anomaly detector? I don't think he does. I think I'm gonna have to buy from the guy outside. Cause he seems to still have one. I could also get a grenade launcher. Damn it. Do you actually sell grenades, though? Because I don't have any. Yeah, I don't see any grenades for the grenade launcher. So there's little point in buying it. Oh, ammo. How am I doing on ammo? Damn it, if only someone helped me. Pretty good amount. Let's get some more AP. There we go. Now, <laughs> is he just gonna keep saying, damn it, if only someone would help me every 10 seconds? I already helped you. You have your weapon back. Stop complaining. Yeah, is there like a, stor like a storage bin in here? I've always got something interesting. Aha, here we go. My information so, well be of use to I can't actually find any ammo for this sold by the barkeep, so I'm just gonna store it here until I can get more use out of it so it doesn't weigh me down. My weight is excellent. One more thing I want to do before I end the episode is repair my stuff. Now that I can actually afford it. 2600 to repair. Okay, that's pretty costly. It's worth it, though. What's my condition? Yeah, it's gone down 5%. Yep. I'm going to do it.
Well, I can get the night vision device, even though it already has it. Maybe it's a better version? Maybe it's better night vision? I don't know. Hmm. An internal rubberized fabric layer. This lining will protect the body in the event the main suit becomes ruptured. It doesn't actually say what it does, though. So I don't think I want it. And what about this? Like, this is a pretty nice weapon. I feel like I should still wait for a better weapon before I start. Yeah, I'm gonna save my money. Let's... Uh, I should probably repair it. Yeah, there we go. How much does this actually cost, though? 2800 That is pretty expensive. Wait a minute. A counterforce rotator installed in the receiver reduces weapon recoil. But then it says recoil plus 55%. I don't understand. Does that reduce recoil or give it more? That is bizarre. Anyway, I'm going to call it a day there. The uh, pretty successful excursion. Found some good stuff, made some good money. Repaired my stuff. Did a quest. Yeah, feeling pretty good about that. So I'll figure out what I want to do next, and I will do that in the next episode. So I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I will be back soon.